All right. First of all, right out of the gate, rest in peace to Arnold Palmer and the Miami pitcher Fernandez that got killed in the boat wreck. Uh, Arnold Palmer, what can you say? A legend. Just like Tim Priest. Who is Tim Priest? Listen at the very end of this beautiful piece of announcery. 117 Gators dives back to throw. Fires. Man, wide open draw. Jennings bobbles it, stays in bound down the sideline to the 20, to the 10, all the way to the checkerboard. Touchdown, Tennessee. What a grab by Jawan Jennings. 67 yards. Dobbs right on target. Jennings is all by himself. Then he had to Wait catch it. it. Tiptoe down the sideline. And the Wait volunteers have battled back. From trailing 21 to 3, and now lead the game right here. 23 21. Now. Get you some of that, Jalen Tabor! <laughs> that is Tim Priest, the color announcer for the voice of the balls, Bob Kessling, and the Ball Network. Uh, also, a great VFL that used to play ball here. Enough about the Florida game, although. I will thoroughly enjoy that till the next time we play the Bastards. Uh, we got Georgia this weekend, and uh, I, I'm addressing this first video to Uncle Lou. Uh, Uncle Lou, you made a video before this weekend saying that should Georgia lose, it doesn't matter because they control their own destiny. And whoever loses the Tennessee-Florida game is in trouble. Not, I'm not quoting you verbatim, but you get the gist. You know what you said. People that saw your video know what you said, that it doesn't matter if Georgia loses. I think a 45-14 to 14 spanking matters. Now, I'm not overly optimistic like a lot of Tennessee fans that think Tennessee's just going to Stroll down to Georgia and pound you guys by 50 just because we scored 38 points in the second half against one of the nation's best defenses. And just because you guys blew goats down in Mississippi this weekend, pardon the pun, but you guys are goats. It's your own name. It matters. You know it matters. I expect a close game down in Athens this weekend. I do. It's Georgia, Tennessee. It's going to be a slobber knocker. A slobber knocker that we're going to win by three touchdowns, but a slobber knocker. I'm not overly optimistic like a lot of Tennessee fans. You know, a lot of Tennessee fans think we're going to win by like 50. Here. We're only going to win by like 21 or so. Um, but I'll take that. I'll take a three-point win. I'll take any point win. Uncle Lou, we need to make a bet. And uh, before I can finalize any bet with you, I have to pay up on my bet to Unc. Well, this is college, not pro. We can bet before I pay up on my NFL bet. Uh, think of something. I'll be thinking of something. We'll get together uh, either on Facebook or in comments or if you want to hop on Ubu one night and we'll discuss it, whatever. Uh, but I'm feeling mighty confident about Tennessee's chances of beating Georgia this weekend. Oh, the Jalen Tabor comment from our color announcer. That's because Jalen Tabor has a big fucking mouth and was running it basically ever since the summer. And uh, Tennessee shut him up. That's how you handle trash talk in football. You let your actions do the talking. Yeah. And 